Of course we know we're ending things with the heavyweights. Let's bump things up a little bit. Who's ready for a light heavyweight co-main event? Let's get the action started in West Palm. Let's bring out our first fighter out of the blue corner. He is Josh Mercado. We're just speaking of him, the relentless Josh Mercado coming in officially at 205.8 pounds, despite saying that anybody at 185 that wants it can come get that, get that smoke, as they say. Um, he is six foot two, coming in um, once again at 205 here. White belt in jiu-jitsu, who did take a year off to train with Coach Asim down at Goat Shed. Now Asim's a, it seems a kickboxer, seems a grappler, seems a wrestler, seems a judo guy, seems a got a little bit of everything. Whatever, whatever you got, he's. Um, I've said in the past, he's given a lot of these guys, and, and I don't mean this to shortchange him, but the biggest thing he's offered to a lot of these fighters is a friend. A friend and a mentor, someone just to give a crap, to care about these guys, to take them in, say, hey, are you training? Hey, are you working? Hey, what are you doing? And sometimes that makes all the difference in the world. Yes, Azeem has an awful lot of experience and an awful lot of knowledge to pass on to his students, and he's got a coaching staff there as well, which is uh, – uh, elite level, but sometimes all it takes is just a guy to care about you, you know what I mean? To get you that little extra push to try harder in the gym. Yeah, and, and everybody that seems to come out of the goat shed yep. doesn't, doesn't seem to have a silver been born with a silver spoon in their mouth. It does seem that way, and Coach Asim is here. He's just not cornering any fighters tonight. He's walking them out, and he's stopping, he's hanging out. He's watching the distance. He's letting the gym run the gym tonight, letting the fighters coach themselves. They're training partners. Uh, excellent approach, excellent idea, right? No, who knows you better than the guy you're sparring with every day? So, now and Ricardo's a big boy. Yeah. Fighting out of the red corner. For sure. Looney Guillaume. Looney, the witch doctor Guillaume out of Palm Beach, Florida, uh, Jupiter Boxing, away of Palm Beach, Florida. He is four and four. Kickboxing record, 22 wins, two losses, one draw. So he slide the experience into his uh, corner for sure for Lune. A, also a big boy himself, 205 pounds, probably 6'3", 6'4", says 6'4". If so, he's all of it. We'll have a reach advantage here. He ain't calling out no 185er, Sean. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. Mm. Uh-uh, he ain't calling out a 201-pounder, much, much less a 185er. And I wonder if Lune's from the island of Palm Beach, putting down Palm Beach, Florida, because uh, I don't know. That'd be, a, that'd be an interesting uh, tale. Wouldn't it, though? Donald Trump's neighbor. Could be. Yeah. Yeah, man, he is six foot four, 205 of horsepower, four and four, but once again, 25 fight kickboxing record, 22 of those wins. So, uh, uh, may not be a surprise if he looks to keep it on the feet today, Sean. And that is a hoss he's taking on in Mercado. Again, he's saying, saying 185, but he's a, he's a decent sized 205, or he will not be outsized by the bigger uh, Looney Guillaume here. Yeah, Lo Lo Looney may, be, may, be, uh, may have a few horsepower less than Mercado, yeah. but uh, he ain't no slouch either. No, he's a big guy, big, strong, big, strong fella. Uh, returning to the XFNK, he's always happy to have him back. 205 featured co-main event of the evening. I believe we're about ready to get it started. Blake Chadwick, let them know, brother. Ladies and gentlemen, on Flow the Sports. following is your XFN 32 New Year's Revolution co-main event of the evening set in the light heavyweight division and brought to you by Fusion CBD Products with three three-minute rounds of action. Introducing first, he is fighting out of the blue corner. This freestyle fighter stands at six feet, two inches tall. He weighed in at 205.8 pounds. He enters this fight with an amateur record of one win and one loss and fighting out of the Goat Shed Academy and Fort Lauderdale, Florida. He is the relentless Josh Mercado. his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He stands at six feet, four inches tall. He weighed in at 204.4 pounds. He enters this fight with a record of four wins and four losses 
and fighting out of Jupiter, Jiu-Jitsu Academy, and Palm Beach, Florida, he is Looney, the Witch Doctor, the Hummy. The Witch Doctor, does he have any voodoo for Mercado? We will see, we will see. Comfortable in the cage, whenever you put it all together, about 30, 33 or so uh, uh, amateur fights between kickboxing and mixed martial arts for Guillaume. Mercado's got to himself, he's coming off a year break for grappling. COVID's a good time. Got COVID, didn't die, caught the body kick as Mercado diving in there. Round number one is underway, hot and heavy, 205 featured. Co-main event here at, U ooh, XFA nice 32, knees. yeah. Oh, big shot to the back of the head. Guillaume's out now, looking to get his composure back. Ooh, that got up there quick. Yeah, that's a, he slung that leg. That'll, that, that'll uh, pause Mercado from jumping in again like that. Yep, very funny, whenever Guillaume came, came in tonight, somebody asked, somebody said, well, there's the heavyweight main event. Oh, my goodness. Looking to work on the grappling, high amplitude takedown for Mercado. Settles into half guard on top. Looked like he put himself into half guard. Right in front of us. He could have went to mount, but it looks like he put himself in half guard. Probably wanted to keep uh, Looney in his, in, his, uh, in his guard, keep him pinned. <laughs> Looney, Looney doing a good guard. job. Got his full guard. Literally right in front of us. On top of us, Sean. Good, good work here from Mercado that year he took off to grapples. Uh, uh, we got off. Looks Moody's like attacking a Kimura there, it's yeah. Tight. It's, oh, oh, it was not. Mus muscled out of it at the last second. Exposed the grip there, did Mercado into full mount, he goes. Oh. Throwing some big punch on the veteran, Looney Guillaume here. Guillaume's gotta get out of here. There's a big, he's tapping. Looney Guillaume taps the strikes. Wow, wow, wow. Who wants that smoke? Joshua Mercado, young man, your year off was well invested. For sure. Whoa. Man, that is a big, heavy guy. That's a heavy base to have on top of you and mount like that. Here we see it again. Loses the Kimura, does Guillaume. And slicing right through into mount. Takes his time to solidify his position, I love it. Shot, shot, shot. Guillaume tries to bump. And he ain't going nowhere. Guillaume starts tapping. And that is all she wrote. That is all she wrote. Joshua Mercado has made a statement. A year off well spent, young man. For sure. For sure. Boom. What else can you say? The Goat Shed has something to celebrate tonight and in the future. They got a lot to celebrate. But uh, Joshua Mercado, somebody has to pop a bottle of champagne on his head. That was a statement. I think we're going to get Ladies the official announcement here. At one minute, 37 seconds of round number one. Your winner, via TKO in the blue corner, the relentless Josh Mercado. Wow. I'm here with Joshua Mercado. Joshua, you told us you took a year off to focus on grappling. You saw a hole in your game. You wanted to train with Coach Hassim to fill that hole. An excellent display of grappling tonight. You were patient, took Mount, and made him pay. Spectacular. Man, you know we took a year off. I tried to get three fights, they didn't fall through. So I was like, man, let's keep working. Kept showing up, kept putting the work. Just kept grinding, kept the head down. Still, until somebody wanted to sign that contract. Two weeks notice, baby. 185 to 5 well, yeah. He said to us, plain and simple, anybody to 185 pounds, 205, 200, 194. He doesn't care. He's bringing smoke for you. Once again, an incredible performance. Welcome back. That was a year off, well spent, and well invested. You are worldwide on Flow Combat. He ain't got nothing else to say. 
Mr. Joshua Mercado.